This past week, I went to visit some grade 10 students and they were invited to, to ask me some questions, but they didn't have many questions. So I, I asked them questions. And one of the questions I asked them is, if you were about to address graduating kindergarten students, what would you tell them? And one student very quickly put up his hand and, and said, I would tell them that life is going to get tougher. And then I was listening to a talk radio um, show and the question was, you know, what do you worry about? And, and people were phoning in with all kinds of worries. And yet the, the person really should have said, what do you worry about? But what are you thankful for? Because, you know, the two kind of go hand in hand. You know, our life is not all about worry and our life is not all about praise and thanksgiving either. You know, we kind of get a mix of both. But really what we're, we're doing, just as we celebrate Palm Sunday, where this is really emphasized, is we participate in the dying and rising of Christ. We recognize life itself will bring crucifixion moments. But in those moments of being crucified, we know that we'll be raised to new life. And, you, you know, it's after, usually after the fact, after you've been through a crucifixion experience where you praise and thank God for that experience. You know, not in the moment, but later on, because something something has come forth from that or some fruit that you are bearing in life benefits yourself and the people in your life. So as we gather around the table, Lord, we gather to participate in Christ dying and rising in us for us and through us and what what a great gift it is so that we can be strengthened to help people who are experiencing a little toughness in their lives.